A car dealership sells four different models of cars. The fuel economy in miles per gallon is shown below for each model. Organize the data using a matrix. Then write a new matrix giving the fuel economy figures for next year's models if each measure of fuel economy increases by 8%. Starting with our uh, fuel economy for this year, notice that we've got um, each, each type of car has first a type of car uh, categorization, so economy, midsize, minivan, and SUV. And then we have a categorization of uh, city driving versus highway driving. And so that's going to create kind of the structure of our matrix. So we'll have economy, midsize, minivan, and SUV for our rows. And for our column, columns, we'll have city driving and highway driving. Um, so that creates our, our matrix for us. So economy cars have 32 miles per gallon city driving and 40 for highway. Midsize of 24 for city and 34 for highway and so forth. Okay, just placing that information in our in our matrix. So this matrix here is a way to organize this information. Um, and then if we're looking at an increase of 8%, uh, that means we need to, well, take each of these numbers and increase by 8%. That means we're going to multiply the matrix by 1.08. Alright, the, the 1 represents the, the fuel economy here and then the 0.08 represents the included, the added uh, 8%. Okay, so 1.08 times uh, that, that matrix. Now we can go ahead and actually multiply the 1.08 by each of these numbers, and that will give us our, uh, our new fuel economy matrix. So this is our matrix that uh, represents the uh, new uh, fuel economy for, for next year's models after the 8% increase.